the KX News Storm Team. 5.48 here on this Monday morning. Welcome back to Good Day Dakota. Yeah, looking forward to some nice warmer weather mm -hmm. since we are at the end of August. Yeah, warmer weather is definitely here. We're going to be above average almost every day this week or at average. The issue is we're going to have heavy winds some days, yeah. especially Wednesday, Thursday. Then we're going to have some more smoke rolling in. Uh, does it reach the surface still up in the air right now? Uh, if it's going to reach the surface or not, but we will have smoke over today into tomorrow before it maybe gets blown out. Yeah, not so not many opportunities to enjoy the warmer weather. Yeah. Yeah. Keep summer here a little longer, but then that dang smoke. Yeah, definitely. Well, we'll start this off on our satellite and radar. Clear skies over much, if not all of the region right now. There may be some light clouds, but even that isn't going to affect that sunrise once it does start to rise here in a little bit. Air quality index right now is showing this moderate rating through the central portions of the state all the way up to the northwest where we're starting to see this unhealthy for sensitive groups as well. And as that smoke starts to move in, that's sort of a preview of what's to come as that smoke gets uh, moved in from the northwest corner of the state. Now, will it be up in the sky or at the surface still up in the air? Models a little bit overdoing it at times. It's what we tr uh, trend to see this year uh, with that surface smoke. Uh, but we could have heavy uh, smokes aloft. Uh, again, that northwest wind is really just all the way up through the atmosphere. That's what's helping really pull in some of that smoke from those Canadian wildfires up in the northwest and that's really going to move in this afternoon into the evening into tomorrow before it finally may start to move out uh, Thursday night into Wednesday morning. But we'll keep an eye on it, especially those air quality indexes because they're going to rise as that smoke moves in later today. Temperatures right now we got us sitting mostly in the mid to lower 50s, but we got some 60, 62 in Bismarck, 61 in Mobridge. We got 63 in Williston and we'll continue to warm up again. We're back right at average for this time of year today. Some areas above average uh, wind speeds and direction five to let's go 15 miles per hour, mostly from the northwest. Uh, that's just what we're going to see all throughout the day today into tomorrow. And then those winds will pick up uh, on Wednesday from a different direction. We'll see that on our wind gust forecast. We will see some wind gusts today, 25 to 30 miles per hour. Calms down tomorrow, but as we get into the Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, that's where we start to see those winds pick up out to the west and really going to pick up Wednesday afternoon, 40 to 45 miles per hour as a front rolls in associated with a low pressure system that is just off screen off north of Montana and that's going to really stay around Wednesday afternoon calm Thursday morning but by Thursday afternoon we'll have another round of those heavy winds and that low pressure system is now uh, north of us uh, through Thursday. Uh, highs this afternoon got us sitting mostly in the mid to lower 80s in the central portion of the state. You move out to the west, get more of those mid to upper 80s, even some lower 90s, 90s in Wolf Point. Uh, warmer air is going to come in tomorrow, uh, and then we're going to see many get up to the mid to upper 80s. Uh, precision cast shows we see dry skies over the next few days. Tuesday there isn't much. There'll be some light cloud cover, but many will see lots of sunshine. You're still going to be dealing with that haze, but once we get to Wednesday, that front rolls through. It's going to bring in some isolated showers and thunderstorm chances Wednesday afternoon into the night. And then we'll have another dry morning before some more rain will move in uh, Thursday afternoon into the evening. And we can see that low pressure system just north of Williston in that northwest corner of the state. Williston five day forecast got us sitting in the 80s day into tomorrow all the way up to the upper 80s Wednesday, maybe some 70s Thursday back to the 80s on Friday. Dickinson 80s all the way through the next five days. We'll have that chance of rain Wednesday night as well. Your might not seven day forecast uh, 80s all the way through probably Friday. Then we'll hit the 90s. Saturday could hit the 90s on Sunday right now showing the upper 80s though and your Bismarck seven day forecast 80s all the way through Friday. Then those 90s start to appear Saturday could also appear on Sunday. <laughs> Labor Day coming up too. Yeah. yeah, the long weekend. I know a lot of people like to go camping over that yeah, weekend, yes. but uh, again, just gonna have to be uh, cognizant yeah. of that smoke. And yeah, hopefully the wildfire smoke leaves after day and we won't yeah. see it the rest of the week because you know, it's gonna be a pretty nice end mm -hmm. of the week as well. So hopefully that wildfire smoke just stays away after the next and two I days. I want to go fishing. I have not been fishing oh, once boy. this summer, which right. is like Got craziness. Still. Yeah. I know, so this weekend, make the yeah. keep the wind away. Yeah, hopefully. Keep the smoke away <laughs> so Alicia can go fishing. Coming up on Good Day Dakota, <laughs> how do some of the best ideas or 